Hello students, let us see this question here. Uh, horizontal spring block system of mass 2 kg executes SHM. When the block is passing through its equilibrium position, an object of mass 1 kg is put on it and the two blocks move together. The new amplitude of the vibration is the A being the initial amplitude. So, okay, so you can say, I can say, so let us zoom in the first case. So, figure is something like this. So, this is the 2 kg block. And suppose this is the mean position. Okay, and this is performing SHM. So, assume this is moving with speed V or something. So, assume this is moving with speed V. And at this instant, another block of mass 1 kg is kept. Okay, so obviously uh, the F external net is zero, so the linear momentum will remain conserved. So I can see the P initial must be equal to P final. So P initial is equal to two into V, and that must be equal to final momentum. So that is three into V dash. Let us assume. So from here I can say this will become two V upon three is equal to V dash. So after this, the new SHM will look like this. This is the block 2 kg, this is 1 kg and now this one is moving with V dash and that is equal to 2 V upon 3 and this one is moving so I can remove here. So this is the initial system 2 kg block moving with V after putting the block 1 kg on, uh, on the top of 2 kg now this is moving with 2 V upon 3 why due to the conservation of linear momentum. Now I can say Right here I will say 1 upon 2, right, 1 upon 2 m into V a square. So this is the kinetic energy and that must be equal to 1 upon 2 k a x square that is the potential energy. So right in the case of SHM as we know the maximum kinetic energy is equal to maximum potential energy. So since, since the 2 kg block is at the mean position, so 1 by 2 mv square is the maximum kinetic energy and maximum potential energy will be 1 upon 2 kx square and these two must be equal. So so this is so let us call this is the equation 1 here. Now in this one I can write the same equation. So k max that is the maximum kinetic energy that is 1 upon 2 m into v square that is 2 v upon 3 square. Okay, and that must be equal to maximum potential energy. So that is 1 upon 2 k. So let us zoom here the amplitude is a1 square. So this is the equation 2. Now I can divide the equation 1 upon 2. So equation 1 bhaga equation 2 if I write here. So I will say 1 upon 2 or you can say this will get cancelled out. So I can write this will become v a square is equal to 1 upon 2 k a square divided by here you will get so 3 will get cancel out from here and 2 will also uh, sorry uh, uh, 3 will my mistake so if you solve this this is 2 a square so 1 2 will get cancel out and this is 3 a square so 1 3 will also get cancel out so so this will become 2 by 3 v a square so that will become 2 by 3 v a square and here you will get 1 upon 2 k a 1 square. So this will also get cancelled out from here. V a square V a square will get cancelled out and from here I can say 3 upon 2 will be equal to a square upon a 1 square. So all I need to find the a 1 here. So I will say a 1 square is equal to 2 upon 3 a square. So from here I can say a 1 is equal to 2 upon 3 root a. So let us see which option is matching 2 upon 3 A, right. So option A is correct. Okay students, I hope you understood this question.